Hi, my name is Pat Massassi, and I'm a sales rep with Scalar Decisions, a technology solution provider based in Toronto, Canada. Today I'm going to spend the next two to three minutes speaking to you about six books that I've read over the last 30 years and how they might be able to help you in your career. Uh, before I begin, just to give you a bit of a background on me, I've spent the last 30 years as a sales rep in Toronto uh, with uh, manufacturers, resellers, and distributors. And prior to that, I have an MBA from York University and a Bachelor of Commerce from the University of Toronto. So the, the young sales reps here at Scalar will often ask me for a good book or a good document to help them understand what's going on in the industry. So here are the six that, I, that I've read over the years. Number one, Crossing the Chasm by Jeffrey Moore. It gives a great idea of how to introduce new technologies into the marketplace. Number two, Spin Selling by Neil Rackham. It gives you a great idea into a methodology and a process by understanding all the needs and implications of the products and solutions you're providing for your customers. Number three, The New Handshake, Sales Meets Social Media. Great introduction to what's going on in the, in the Sales 2.0 and Sales 3.0 and using tools such as LinkedIn and Twitter to help get to your customers. Number four, Blade Servers and Virtualization. I mentioned this on my last video. Great introduction and a great refresher to understand what's happening in the computing industry today and the, around the whole thing, around consolidation with Blades and Virtualization. Number five, I couldn't find my copy of the original The Wealthy Barber. And this one's the wealthy barber returns. But you know, if you're going to be successful selling, hopefully you'll make some commissions and, and good incomes. This will give you a great idea as to what to do with all that income. Book number six I don't have with me, but it's actually my personal favorite of all time. And whether you read it, watch the film, or, or visit the musical, The Wizard of Oz. It's a great book into the self-doubt that all of us have as human beings, that we don't have enough courage, enough heart, enough brains to go after our goals, and oftentimes we're following someone else's yellow brick road to get there. Great book. If you haven't read it, or you have read it, read it again. And as a bonus, a book that I think I'm going to read in the next six months is a book called The Big Switch, Rewiring the World from Edison to Google. And it looks at what's going on with cloud computing and how it relates to what went on with the electric industry in the early 1900s. So with that, just remember that if it was easy, anybody could do it.